Okay, so I've got a Sim 800C V2, which I bought from the internet and I've connected it to my PC. And in this video, I'm going to show you how it's done. So I've got the 800C, see, 800C V2, that's the board. And I've got it wired into a USB UART. And that's the other end of it. And that plugs into my PC. The USB UART. I've got the red, that's 5 volts. The black is the ground. The white is the TX. And that goes to my white cable. And green is the RX. That goes to my green cable. Here, yeah, and on the SIM 800C V2, we can see the red. I'm connecting to VCC in. The black, I'm connecting to GND or ground. The green, I'm connecting to the RXD here and the wire on TXD. And that works. Let's just wire that up, plug it into the computer and I'll show you what happens. I'm going to plug that into my computer now. Watch the COM ports there. Do that. Plug that in. Excellent. So it showed up on COM port 5. My details for COM port 5 are 9600. All defaults. Now let's uh, connect the GND. Okay, so it's connected. You can sort of see a red glow flashing underneath. I'm going to turn that over. Now, flashing once a second like that usually means there's some kind of problem. I don't have a SIM card plugged in, which is one problem. Anyway, let's open up Putty and connect to it. Ser serial COM5 9600 open. Open Putty. Now, if all goes well, I should be able to send an AT command. AT, enter. There we go. Okay. AT, enter. Now, putty seems quite strange. Sometimes it doesn't show me the characters I'm typing. This time it is. Anyway, ATI. Okay, SIM 800 R14.18. Excellent. So that SIM module is connected to my PC via the USB UART. Thanks for watching. Remember to like, comment, subscribe and share.